coming for you! Look at these creatures, Patrick! They're... they're... Funny? No, scary! Oh, yeah, yeah, that was gonna be my second guess. No, this whole place is frightening! It's cold, it's moist, and it smells like the dumpster behind the chum bucket. Well, that sure sounds a lot like this puddle of ooze you're standing in. Ew! It must be the remains of the victims of the monster that came through here. We have to hurry and find Gary! Candy find a warm and safe place? Too bad I left my candy bar bag in my candy bar bag carrying bag. I guess I have to put it in my mouth instead. Wait a tide. Something about this ooze seems very familiar. Mm. Mm. Calcium. With a faint trace of protein. And lots of love. That's not ooze, that's slime! Gary slime! That is a lot of slime for such a tiny snail. He must be so scared. We gotta find him! All we have to do is just follow the slime trail through the dark, scary, horrifying city! <laughs>
For you and me! I'm afraid I have not. I'm in the middle of crucial organizing business for the Snail Cup. If you want to enter the race, you need to pay the participation fee of five candy bars. There's only one way to get the amount of candy we need. Take it from babies? No, we go trick-or-treating. Oh, that works too, I guess. I already told you. Trick or candy, candy, candy. Chance you know where I could find some candies? There's a weird fish living in a house above the city. You could try that. The pass is next to me, but the way up is dangerous. A little dabble do ya. Some guy said he saw the monster and it made a horrible hiss at him. Don't you know people have phobias? Sorry, I didn't know my costume was that scary. What are you afraid of? Boxes, man, boxes. You never know what'll be inside or where they'll take you. And then it's too late, and you look just like one. All square-like. Sometimes boxes have good things in them, like Krabby Patties. Oh, yeah. I guess you're right. Here's some candy. Thank you. Balloons? Don't you know people have phobias? Mm -hmm. 
What a nice costume! How can I help you, young fellows? Candy! Candy, 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 candy! Oh, of course, sweetie. Here, have a candy bar. Ah! Wow, vintage! Thanks! Aw, oh, you look adorable. Trick or treat! I've been trying to find chocolate for three days. There's almost nothing left. Except for, well, I could tell you, but you have to promise to split the spoils. I'm all ears! Well, actually, I'm mostly cellulose, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, a weird and very heavy rock crashed behind my house. Right on my chocolate shed. Maybe you can move it. Here, let me open the gate for you. Everyone at my school is the smartest, most talented, most coolest kid because I'm not sure, Mom. They're gonna make fun of my costume. It's gonna be okay. Don't be scared. Your costume looks great. Thanks. Can't understand your accent. Trick or treat. Oh, why didn't you say so? Here, have a candy bar. And nice costume, by the way. Thank you. See my snail? Tiny, cute, sweet, with very expressive eyelashes. If he's really sweet, then the monster probably took him. It ruined everyone's Halloween by stealing our sweets. The last time it was seen, it crawled down the racing track. I think the track probably leads all the way to its lair. There it feasts on innocent candy and pets. Poor Gary. Patrick, we need to find more candy to get on that racing track. Here, have one of my candy bars for the participation fee. Your awesome costume deserves it. Thanks. That's all the candy we need. Now we can give it all away to Mrs. Puff. Do, 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 we, do we have to?
Again. Did you bring the participation fee candy? With nuts! Fancy. Now keep still. This is going to hurt. Wait, what? It's a snail race. You have to be a snail and fast. Go! <laughs> Survived. Uh, I mean, you won the race. <laughs> Congratulations. Now go bother the other kids. How do you know my name? It's me, Patrick. I thought I was Patrick. No, I'm SpongeBob, you're Patrick. Oh. Maybe we should turn on some lights and make sure. SpongeBob, it's too dark here. Do something. These cables are glowing. Maybe they feel pretty. Bow, 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 bow.
if my eyes are closed or if it's just dark. Not just dark, Patrick. This is the best of darkness. I mean, 
<clears throat> Sandy. The name's Candy, with a C as hard as the toffee in Grandma's candy dish. Thank you for bringing the power back. We're looking for my pet snail, Gary. He got lost, probably kidnapped by a monster. Have you seen him? Haven't seen your pet around, I'm afraid. But that monster, they say its lair is in the museum. It's dangerous, but it might be your best chance of finding your little critter. Sounds reasonable. We should ask this monster if it's seen Gary. Patrick, I don't think monsters can talk. You know what? My little monster theater has been reset. You mind giving me a hand with putting it back in order? If you do, I'll open the way to the museum for you, so you can go look for that monster and your friend. I don't like it, but if there's a chance Gary is with this monster, we have no other choice. Oh, poor Gary. Let's get this theater fixed. arriving. Can't have a scary show with this jolly balloon bobbing about. Oh, look at these gallons of slime, Patrick. Gary must be terrified, poor thing. Maybe it's not all Gary slime. Maybe the monster got a whole bunch of snails. More sweet babies in danger? Oh, say it isn't so. to a whole museum? Gary is so learned.
told you. Look at all those snails the monster kidnapped! Look! It's scary! Monster snail seeing us! Gary is the monster snail! Huh? They grow up so fast, don't they? These massive amounts of candy bars must have given him a sugar rush. We can't take him back home like this. We have to cut off his candy supply first. Already on it, buddy! <laughs> here before we're all buried in the rubble. But Gary is still giant! Don't worry. I'm sure he'll go back to normal once we get him home. I sure hope you're right, Patrick. I've never been wrong about anything yet. For once in my life, I think I might have been wrong. like someone's controlling me. Whoa. Lucky. Great. Now my whole rock is covered in snail slime. I just had it cleaned when I moved in, too. I know it's a very challenging situation. But could you stop yammering? I'm trying to concentrate. Uh, 
Uh, that was sheer luck. <clears throat> uh, speaking of which, good news! I found that squiddy neighbor of yours. Just to uh, give me more jelly and your new cosmic costume will get you to him. Maybe I'll just stay here and nap under my rock. Oh, sorry, Patrick. Balloons and heavy rocks don't go well together. Besides Fine! But Squidward owes me a nap when we find him. Ah, I look like I'm from the Stone Age. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like some idiot who lives under a rock. <laughs>